Hi guys, and welcome back to yet another AirPods episode. I was going back to the dormitory because we were just out wandering in the castle at night, and I couldn't take the shortcut into the up to the dormitory. So yeah, this is the reason they wanted this cutscene to be played. What do you mean, Reptile Kale? What's that voice? Sounds like it's coming from in there. Harry, you're gonna go in alone? Oh god. There's a message on the wall. The chamber has been opened. Enemies of the air, be beware. Oh god. We just sneak past these two guys. My cat, my cat, what's happened to Mrs. Norris? You, 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 you murdered my cat. Oh, the man comes. He looks very derpy, but yes. Argus? She's not dead, Argus. Not dead? She's been petrified, but now I cannot say. How? I cannot say. Ask him. No. No second you could have done this. It could take dark. It would take dark magic of the most advanced. He did it. Potter did it. I never touched Mrs. Norris. I'm truly sorry that this has to happen to Argus. There is no evidence at all that Potter has done anything wrong. My cat has been petrified. We will be able to cure her, Argus. Madame Sprite has recently produced um, some mandrakes. As soon as they have reached full size, I will have a potion made, which will revive Mrs. Norris. Harry, you may go. Okay, so we saw all this alone. That's kind of sad. No tree together. We are just all alone. With the grown-ups. Poor Harry. Or at least we can take the shortcut up now. Oh no, you are not the shortcut. God damn it, I have to run all the way up. We gotta tell we gotta tell Ron and Hermione about this. I'm probably gonna get sliced in pieces by this um by one of the statues that's on the way in the staircase. Uh, if you wonder why I look like I look <laughs> with the way I look with my eyes, um, I'm, I'm just very tired, sadly. Uh, uh, my face is tired. I'm not actually tired because hence why I'm recording. Like if I were tired, I wouldn't record. Uh, my body is just exhausted from everything. But none of that. We have reached the top floor. No, almost. Okay, one more and you are gonna kill me, dude. One more and you will kill me, bruh. Now you need to pair this one because we need to fill up and heal up. I wonder if we sleep if the health will get restored like it does in most games. I don't think that is how it works, but let's speak to Ron, shall we? Let's do a quick save in case anything like crashes or anything. Um, it's probably up in the dormitory, eh? so let's go there. It has been a while since we- I know we talked to Hermione two episodes ago, but it still feels like way too long ago <laughs> in my opinion. Oh, hey, Ron. How are you? Good night, Harry. You're not gonna talk about what just happened? You're just gonna act... Okay, full health from sleeping. Nice. We're not gonna talk about anything that happened yet last night? Really, dude? Okay. Fine by me. Let's hope her mind... Oh. Well, hello there, Oliver. We've got flying lesson in the wooded practice area in the grounds. Now follow me, Potter, and let's let's get a move on. Have a look at the map of Hogwarts grounds if you're not sure where to go. Okay, so I guess this is uh, like a normal map. Owl scrolls, the egg. Is this the map? What? 
kind of cool how Harry's like running there, his little eight bit. Is that all? That is not that uh, helpful in my opinion. Yeah. Yeah. I guess that was all, so it's not a really the real map. Okay then. So so we don't have to sleep again if we die. Which I hope we don't. Let's just have a save there, yeah. Because when I went into the portrait room before, uh, the, all the portraits were uh, empty actually. Having trouble keeping up, Potter? I hope you've got your wits about you on the, on the Quidditch pitch. Come on. What kind of accent does he have in the movie, really? Is this Scottish? What is it? Now to recall where the Quidditch pitch is. Okay, I found it. <laughs> I had to go way b back down here. <laughs> Let's hope this is the right one. Hi Harry, the object of Quidditch is to cast... Oh, okay. Um, okay, yeah, I know this. But watch out, Slytherin's new seeker is Draco Malfoy. Try and avo avoid the plodgers too, as they will reduce your boost bar and slow you down if they hit you. Let's win the Quidditch Cup. Oliver Wood. I don't know about that, but we can always try, mate. Always try. I thought we were gonna go through the gate here, but I guess not. We're gonna go to the wooded area of the Quidditch pitch. What does that exactly mean? Room shed. Rain practice? Uh, I would say no. Actually, thank you for letting me out of there. <laughs> but now we know we can practice and all that. Okay, excuse you, where am I actually supposed to go? Well. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Jesus. We need to practice and practice hard. There's a, f a flitter bee in this area that I want you to catch as quickly as you can. There is no way I'm going to let Slytherin win the Quidditch Cup this year. The record stands at 60 seconds for this challenge. Each of you can do a lot better than that. If you complete the challenge in under 30 seconds, you will be given a wizard card. Don't forget to go to the broom shed to practice. Wouldn't mind searching. Uh, earning some of those wizard cards myself. To accelerate, hold down the A button and use the control pad. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's do this. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how this will go, actually. I should, maybe I should have practiced. Well done, Harry. You've earned a wizard card for the beating best time for the challenge. You can return to the flying practice whenever you like, should you wish to try and better time challenges. Simply visit the broom shed, which you can find in the school grounds, and choose the challenge you wish to practice. Ah. And then we can see Hermione coming up to us. <laughs> uh, oh, and she's still alive. Cool. Captain of the uh, of the only all-female natural Quidditch team, the Hollyhead Harpies. <sighs> I didn't know they were full female, that's cool. Hello, Harry. We got Shams now with Professor Flitwick. It's on the second floor. Let's go. Okay, that sounds good. Um, but you know what? We're gonna actually have a short episode today. Because um, it's getting kind of late and I'm quite tired. So, uh, uh, which is kind of late, I mean like it's almost 2 a.m. Uh, oh, cool, a chest. Oh, with a card? Wow, what a cool way to end it then. Um, it's an entire venomous tentacular for a pet and survived though is still purple. Oh, that guy, that is why he's purple. Hmm. 
Okay, but yeah, that is gonna be all for this episode. Uh, another one? Ah, oh, it's just a frog. Okay. Um, yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, you know exactly what to do. Leave a like, and if you want to see more content from me, I suggest you subscribe. And I hope we see each other for my next video. Bye, guys. <laughs>